looks very excited there, doesn't he, Colin? Looks excited to be back in that ring. Oh, he looks great, yeah. Look at him. Just the way he walked in there, he was looking so confident it's and so excited, excited even. Yeah, he looks really excited to be back in that ring. And can you blame him, really? He's been out for so long. Oh, it's... He looks really good. Both boxers are in good, good physical condition. Um, uh, both boxers ready to go. It's going to be an exciting opening round for sure. We need to see how this will pan out. I'm excited to see how Rakim no will take this fight now. No punches below the bed. When I say stop, stop box. When I say break, okay, stop back. Box. Any questions? Any questions? Good luck. Touch gloves. Bending, getting ready. I like to see Rakim taking it easy, keeping his footwork very steady. But Brendan looks very eager to go. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, first round begins. Rakim taking the center of the ring early on. He looks bigger this time around, Colin. He does look, doesn't he? He looks quite big, doesn't he? Both having a real good look at each other here, they do as now. Rakeem very steady early on, not rushing, good to see. He's not rushing too much, is he, Colin? No, he's, he's standing back and he's just assessing what's going on at the moment. I think the both of them are waiting to see what the other one's going to do because there's been a lot of hype about this fight, though. Mm -hmm. Rakeem definitely has something to prove. Oh, for sure. He looks quite ready to do it. Brendan's very sharp early on. Popping out that jab very, very fast. I noticed he caught him a couple of times already with the jab. Yeah. Great movement there. Very good from Brendan. Definitely can see Rakim has calmed down a little bit. Not been rushing too much there, Colin. He does seem a lot calmer, a lot mm -hmm. more composed with himself. You His footwork looks a little better up to now, the way he stances. I think good, he good. caught one yeah. there. But he rolled it off very well. He did. Being a little bit wild there. Brendan getting out of range very good. Be careful coming in like That's that. That's what Brandon's yeah. looking for exactly. that right hook. He's yeah. quite open oh, to the right hook. There good we right go. Hand, good right hand early on. Again, he came in. He's throwing that wild shot and he's leaving himself wide That's open. I was, was just about to say yeah. he's open for the right hook, and he was. This is what Brendan now needs to do. Brendan now needs to close the fight. Unlike he last needs to step fight. It he's hurt him early on. He's hurt him. Oh, yeah. it's good. Rakeem's in trouble here early on. Big trouble. He's unsteady on his feet. Yep. He needs this round to end for him. He needs to clinch. He I think the ref, the ref. Oh, oh dear. That's a terrific out. knockout. That was a shocking knockout. I hope he's okay. That was a, a tremendous right hook there from Brendan. Rakim still on the floor. Yep. He took an amazing shot to his chin there. I hope he's okay. Brandon rightly going over yep. to see if he's okay, which is a good, nice to see. Tremendous right hook there. Look, I mean. What a terrific right hook. Rick, look, it's Rakim's own fault there. He was in trouble and he didn't clinch. He didn't clinch up. It, it, you know, he, he invited the pressure. You know, he got dropped with a good right hand early on. Then he never fully recovered from that. That's what sent him over the second time round. But you stated he threw a wild shot and the minute he threw that shot, and then within 30 seconds, he threw two more, and that's where they got caught. The first, I think we're going to see the first knock down here. You can see, look where, look at where Rakim's left hand is down. Crack, oh. straight over the top. 
Very good, very good right hand that sent him. And he never fully recovered from that. Oh. Look at Brendan there. Look, as he threw the right hand, he anticipated something else coming through. This is purely where Rakim hasn't recovered here. And this is what sent him down. He never recovered there. So this is the lack of experience. This is where he should be now here, clinching and holding on. Of course, Not, he's got to get in. He's got to get close. Back. Right oh, hook, that and that's it. it. When a boxer, oh, when a boxer folds over in that fashion, you know it's game over. He was totally asleep before he hit the exactly, ground. Exactly, one hundred percent. But this is the problem because he here he's trying to buy time. He's very, very clinching very well, boxing very well, tightly. But why does he need to throw this wild left hook? Oh. He just purely, purely open and invited the right hook. More importantly, he's still not got up out. It's quite concerning. Obviously, they're going to keep him there to be sure they yeah. can get him on his feet. They won't, ru they won't rush anything. No. Yeah, there you go. Now they're getting him up now. Getting That's up, great to see. To his feet now. He still doesn't know where he is, though, Colin. No. He's still not. He definitely doesn't know where he is, unfortunately. You can see Brendan trying to offer his respect there, but uh, I think Rakim's trying, trying to get to terms with what's happened. Brilliant, nice work by Brandon. You can't fault him on anything he did, straight from the off. Colin, what did I say straight away? If Rakim doesn't ad adapt and doesn't correct the mistakes he did, to a certain extent, it's going to be an early night for Medlam. That's what happened. I'm surprised that he didn't, instead of backing off onto the ropes, I'm surprised he didn't come forward and just clinch. That's what he needed to do. Try and tie there. him up, That's try and tie Brandon do. up. He should have been, he, look, he, he was hurt from the original knockdown. He never recovered. The second Ladies one, he got toppled over purely because of the effect the first punch had. But the By last one was purely his own fault. He needed, After two minutes he needed to clinch, he needed to buy time. First round, red corner, Brendan Bojon Borch. Um, so yeah, unfortunately, it didn't, it didn't pan out the way Rakim wanted for sure. But um, I'd just like to hear what Brendan has to say now. Um, and we're, we're going inside to the ring.